What is going on guys, Ducks and Samarni. I hope you guys are having a great day. Right now it's 7.50, 7.54 in the morning, and I just finished doing all of my double uploads for my week when I go to Germany. I got every single video out. I have the surprising Jeanette. I'm waiting for Justin to send that to me, but these are five videos. So one, two, three, four, and then surprising Jeanette. That makes five videos while I'm away. Also these vlogs, so there's gonna be double uploads every single day. Nothing's gonna change, but I literally just got finished. It's almost eight in the morning. I'm gonna go to sleep until 11.30. I'm gonna go to the gym at 12, and then I have a flight to catch. I'm gonna leave my house by three, so I gotta get a lot of packing done. But first, I'm going to go to sleep, then I'm going to go to the gym, and then I'm going to pack. I'm going to see you guys after I sleep in a little back. Right now, guys, it's 11.55 in the afternoon. I slept for about three and a half hours. You guys couldn't tell my eyes. No, my eyes don't look that bloodshot, but they feel tired as hell. They feel heavy. They feel really heavy. Every time I blink, it really, really hurts. You know, I was up really late last night making those videos, and I'm happy I got a lot of stuff done. But now, I'm going to be heading over to the gym with Dan. We're going to work out, hopefully, some shoulders. He's probably going to want to do some chest because it's a Monday. But after we do our workout, I got to be out of there at the gym by, like, 145. I got to come home. I got to shower. I have all these clothes. I'm going to put all these clothes in a bag. I'm going to pack up, and I'm going to be heading over to Gamescom and representing FaZe Clan at the Black Ops 3 multiplayer esports reveal. <laughs> That's crazy. I've never been to Germany before for, for game. I've been to Germany once, but I've never been there since I was 12 years old. Never been to play Call of Duty. I'm so excited. I'm so excited, but I gotta get to the gym. I gotta work out. I gotta hang out with Dan, and I still gotta pack, so we'll see you guys soon. All right, guys, just got to the gym. This is my boy Shelby, and this is one of my really good friends that I work out. This is also, I don't know if you guys know Maurice and Chris, but he trains with me, Maurice, and Chris all the time. He's a part of the team, and since he's a part of the team, See Dan, this is the this is the um, official handshake that we have. We do like a little a fist bump, like boom, and then boom. Oh my bad, I can't I can't do it with the camera in the hand, but I got a little little bit of Gymshark swag for you. It came in the mail. Thank you, sir. I got you some nice sweatpants. Those are nice. Those are good. And Dan, Dan, I got you, bro. I got you, bro. I know these aren't the same shirts that you wanted. I know they're not the same shirt you want. I sent you a text. I was like, yo, if you want me to hit them up to see if I can get the other ones. You good? And I got one more for you, Dan. Oh, man. Actually, you know what? I'm going to give this one to Shelby. This gray one to Shelby. I was going to give it to Dan. You want that one, Dan? I mean, you can trade with him. I, I just feel bad giving Dan three shirts and just giving you some sweatpants. I got to get you at least a shirt, too. Appreciate you, man. You're the homie, man. Appreciate you. And you too, Dan. Thanks, big dog. All right, guys, we're killing a shoulder workout right now. We're doing Dan's exercise. Usually what we'll do is I'll do something, I'll put us through a routine, and then he'll put us through the next routine. So right now what we're doing is kind of like a box with dumbbells. So you go up to the side and down and then reverse. So this really gets your shoulders. It gets a really good burn. As you can see, Dan's going to push himself as far as he could go every single time. <laughs> Here you can see Doug doing some rear delts. He's pushing himself to his limits, but his limits aren't very high. It's okay though. We'll fix them. Getting a nice squeeze in the, the back of his shoulders there. And it's all good. See that Gym Shark logo? I'm coming for you, Gym Shark. Gym Dolphin, 2015. Guys, we're heading out of the gym now. We got a protein shake. We just killed a shoulder workout. I'm not gonna see Dan until at least on maybe Friday. I fly back on Friday. I'm not sure what time, but if not Friday, I'm gonna be Couldn't wait for you to leave. Yeah, I know you were talking shit about me when I was doing my when I was doing my things in the back. I was I was gassing Dan up. Yeah, I know take some shit. take some uh, some media coverage of Fallout 4, bro. I'm really excited for that shit. I'm not gonna do that probably. Why not, man? But I might check out the booth and I'll let you know. I'll give you a text. All right, all right. Or just shoot me a text and be like, yo, how's Fallout 4? Because I know he likes Fallout 4 a lot. I'm gonna be in Gamescom strictly to play Black Ops 3, and I'm so freaking excited. But so excited, dude. Bro. Shut up. If you were in my position, you'd be saying the same shit too. If I was gonna play Fallout 4, I would. <laughs> but guys, I'm gonna go back home. I got like 
45 minutes to shower and pack, so we really gotta get going. So I just got out of the shower, I just got a clean shave, it's 2.30, I gotta leave my house by 3, and I still need to pack, so guys, I'm gonna be right back. And just like that, guys, we're all packed, we got like 6 days of clothes, even though we're only gonna be there for 4 days. I got my laptop that I'm absolutely in love with, I still gotta sell this MacBook, that's uh, under this book that I have here. I still gotta sell the MacBook, and then I got everything that I need, all my utensils to record videos, I'm gonna do my best to bring you guys as much information about Black Ops 3, maybe some, you know, entertaining vlogs in, in some sense. I'll make it as entertaining as possible, but I also want to make it informative because I know you guys want to know about competitive Black Ops 3. You're most likely going to be watching the live stream if you're watching this video, but I want to give you guys a more in-depth analysis of the game as far as competitive. I don't want to be, you know, copying off of Ali A and T Martin, and I don't want to be doing what they do on their channel, so I'm going to let them do their thing with that, but for me and my channel, I'm a pro player. I'm going out there to play the game competitively, so I'm going to let you guys know how I think of the game competitively, what I expect from the game, and what my expectation and how excited like I'm so excited I can't wait I can't wait but it's 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 238 right now I just started a lot but it's 238 I still got to get an uber I still got to finish you know all my packing I gotta double check everything again if you guys um, watch one of my videos I'm not gonna spoil what happened but um there's a, there's a story behind one of the Call of Duty videos I have coming up on my channel always double check everything guys don't make the same mistake that I made you guys will find out soon on my channel you guys are gonna see the title and the thumbnail you're gonna click it you're gonna know I made a huge mistake and I'm really grateful that I was able to bounce back from it but I gotta pack all this stuff, I gotta get an Uber, and I'll catch you guys when I get to the airport. Alright guys, it's 4.30 in the afternoon right now, my flight's gonna start boarding in a half an hour, so it looks like I'm gonna make it. This airport is extremely packed, there's literally no seats anywhere that I go. So I'm just sitting down with this gentleman over here, this nice sir, and I got my, uh, my McDonald's, I got some french fries, I got some chicken nuggets, and I got a Coke. I know it's not the healthiest thing, but I need to eat something before I get on this flight. You wanna say anything to my vlog? Nice to meet you. You seem to be a good guy. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. Yeah. Positive vibes, guys. Positive vibes, people. All right, guys. So we just got to Germany. I'm extremely tired. I probably slept for five hours in the past two days. And this is my hotel. It's apparently, according to my driver, it's the nicest hotel. This is at the Hyatt. I just want to give you guys a 360 because this is pretty dope. Apparently, this is the biggest church in all of Germany. I forgot what he said the name of it was, but there's also this cool bridge to the right. Uh, there's like a man on a horse over here, which is pretty cool. It looks a lot better off the camera than it does on the camera. But there's like a boat construction it's a giant city and um, I'm just really excited to be here obviously I think we start today I think we start playing today on the live stream if you guys want to go check that out um, I'm probably gonna put a link in the description if not I'm sure you guys are gonna find it. it's gonna be all over social media but like I said three hours of sleep I'm extremely exhausted I'm extremely tired I'm gonna go inside my hotel room I'm gonna give you guys a quick room tour right, guys just got to the hotel room it's pretty nice for one person check it out we got a seat over here a giant king size bed. This is my laptop. This is where I'm going to be doing all my videos. Obviously, I'm on Social Blade a lot. I'm always on this website. This is my YouTube channel, my Twitter. And I did not remember to bring one of the plugs because in Germany they have these different outlets. They don't have the same outlets that you have in America. So this is not going to work when I try to plug it into here. So I got to get one of those because I need to use my laptop when I'm here. And this is the hallway to my room to get out of here. And this is a bathroom, which is really, really nice. Check it out, guys. It's like a giant. A uh, bathtub, a shower, and they have the little disposable shower head too for the bathtub. I'm probably not going to use that, but it's pretty cool. Then there's another mirror over here with the sink. And then you have the toilet over here. And it's a little bit different. They have the toilet paper on here like this. And they have another one over here. So Germany is a little bit different. They also have a, um, a phone here so you can like, call people when you're on the bathroom. So that's pretty cool with bathrooms as well. So uh, it's definitely an upgrade from New York City. That was the last time I was in a hotel, I think. No, I was in a hotel in Mexico, but when I was in New York City, the hotel room is literally the size of this one bed. So what I really like is that it has high ceilings because all the other hotels in New York City, the ceilings are like literally up to here. So you just feel suffocated the entire time. So um, it's just, it's a nice place. It's a really nice area, I'm excited. I've only been to Germany once in my life when I was 12 years old with my family. And now I'm here again to play Call of Duty Black Ops 3. So I know you guys really, really wanna see that game. You guys really wanna know what's gonna happen with that game. How's it gonna be? How's it gonna play out? All I know for a fact is that Merc and TP are the only two pro players from North America that I know that are here. There might be another one. If there is another one, I don't know. But uh, I definitely know that there's only Merc and TP. And then there's a bunch of Australian and Italian and Spanish players as well. So I'm not sure how they're going to be sorting us all up. But 
I'm really excited to play. I'm going to get this vlog up right now. I probably slept for six hours in the past two days, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching. It might have been a little bit shorter than my usual vlogs, but I'm just really excited to be here. I can't wait to get as much footage as I possibly can and let you guys know all the competitive Black Ops 3 information that I do know once I find it out this weekend. So if you guys have any questions at all, put it in the comments down below. Thank you guys again so much for watching my vlogs and all my videos every single day. You guys make my day every day. I know you guys always tell me that you know I make you really happy. You guys make me really happy. The fact that you guys are supporting me so much. So thank you again for watching. This has been your boy Ducks and Martin and I'm out guys. Peace.